Happy Monday, everybody. I love Monday. I really do. It's like a, a fresh start all the time, right? Um, so Mondays for me are an extra special check-in to mindset. Um, if, if you've talked to me before, if you know anything about me, mindset is huge in my world. I truly believe that fitness is just um, one of many avenues to create a really positive human being, right? Someone who's excited about life and looking at life with the rose colored glasses um, and, and feeling accomplished, feeling proud and spreading that positivity everywhere. Um, and that, that really is what I believe fitness does for people, right? But let's be real. You don't just wake up with a positive mindset, right? Like, if you have shit going on in your life, as we all do, and you have, um, you know, maybe you're depressed. Maybe your finances aren't where you want them to be. Maybe your body is not where you want it to be. Um, maybe you're not living in the place you want or having the family relationships or the spiritual relationships that you want. It's difficult to just wake up one day and go, oh, I got a positive mindset now. Yeah, it's just there, right? <laughs> it doesn't work that way. Um, but one of the quickest and easiest ways to create a positive mindset, you know, it takes time, just like creating muscles in your body takes time. It's something you have to work on, but one of the easiest ways that you can work on that is by watching what you focus on watching what you focus on what you pay attention to you will get more of like that's that's not mumbo jumbo it's actually science y'all what you pay attention to you get more of so science behind it you have this part of your brain called the reticular activating system and it is this part of your brain's job to filter out some information. There is so much data coming at you. This is shit coming at you. <laughs> There's so much data coming at you every single moment that if your brain actually took all of that in, you would be a freaking crazy person, right? Um, so it is the reticular activating system's job to filter out some of that information and help you to only pay attention to certain things. But part of how we affect that system is what we think about what we pay attention to, it goes, oh, okay, we're going to pay attention to more of that, right? Like, thanks for the, thanks for the help. Thanks for telling me what to pay attention, pay attention to. I'm going to pay attention to more of that, right? So like, try this exercise. I want you to like, see how powerful the paying attention thing is. It's one of my favorite things. If you've done it before, do it again with me. It never gets old, right? So wherever you are right now, unless you're driving, stop and look around and find everything green, find the green. Where's the green? Do you see the green? Is it a mailbox? Is it something in your, what you look for, you get. It's science. It's brain research. What you look for, you get. So what does it have to do with a positive mindset? Well, you know, if you're looking for, of course it's not intentional when you're going like, man, I had a bad day or God, my, my bank account is not where I want it or my relationship is sucking right now or oh, gosh, I wish I had some more friends or I wish I was out tonight. It'd be really fun to go out and man. more of that stuff, right? You're telling your brain that that's what's important to focus on and it will go find more, right? It will, it will validate your beliefs about like, oh, life is so shitty today by seeing, by paying attention to more shitty stuff. It is that simple, right? So how do we overcome all of that? Of course there's shitty situations, right? It is your job to focus on something good. It is your job to take control of your brain. Nobody else is going to do it for you. No one else is going to put good shit in there. They won't. They're, they're dealing with their own crap, right? Everyone's dealing with some shit. So it is your job to find at least, you guys, just one, right? Start with one. If this is really hard for you, start with one awesome thing that you want to focus more on, right? And how do we decide what we're going to focus on? Well, what do you want? And not what things do you want? Not how do you want to look? How do you want to feel, right? What is your outcome? How do you want to feel? So if you want to feel happy, if you want to feel joy or peace or abundance or wealth, 
um, or comfort or safety or security, whatever those things are that you want to feel. Focus on feeling that. Focus on something that makes you feel that way and I guarantee you will get more of that. And that is how you ultimately create a super positive mindset. So when you wake up and you're like, oh, I woke up on the wrong side of the bed and I'm already feeling so shitty today and I'm depressed and I don't wanna go work and it's your job to stop right there and find one thing to focus on that is something you want to feel. Do you wanna feel happy? Do you wanna feel excited about your day? You gotta find one thing and then focus on that. And I promise if you do that in that minute, then you will find more of that. And if you do that every day, just like working out, you will create a more positive mindset. Just like working out every day, you will create a healthier body, right? A healthy mind is part of a healthy body. It's all connected and you gotta do some of the work, right? So. I really encourage you to do that. If you enjoyed this, please invite your friends to this group. This is the kind of stuff that I think is paramount to creating a better life for yourself, a better body, a better mind, a better relationship, a better family. This is how it starts. And we put a lot of this stuff in here to make sure that you guys are taken care of. So happy Monday. Get your mind on right. Go find something amazing to focus on. And um, yeah, bring it. Bring it, y'all. You got one life. Bring it. Mwah. Lots of love.